I was asked to do a short video on how to straighten an image in Photoshop. First thing I'm going to do, this is Photoshop CS3, which is an older version. So I'm just going to, first of all, get my double column toolbar. No matter what version of the software that you're using, you need to use the measure tool. And in this version of the software, the measure tool is down here. In the newest version of the software, it would be somewhere up here but maybe the third or the fourth item down so wherever you have to go to get your measure tool that is the item that we're using to straighten the way that the measure tool works is that you click to set your first point and you drag out the second point and you can see here that if i let go of the points at any point in time i can grab them again and i can reposition each point by clicking and dragging on the point if I need to clear the points for any reason, if I go up to the options bar and click the clear button, I can then, whilst I'm still on the measure tool, replot some points of interest. The way that the measure tool works is you need to measure either a vertical or a horizontal that is actually slanted. And this isn't a great subject simply because there's so many angles on it and it's not a true vertical. They're all kind of angled. So if I go for the side of the paint tall building, and if I just zoom in a tad here so that we can see. So if I start my plot there and just take it down the edge of the building, and you can make it as long or as short as you want. And I've just let go of that second point. If I needed to replot those or move them, I can just grab them and shift them along. So whenever I've got that done, I just go and fill screen there again. You go into your image menu, down to rotate canvas, and you click on the arbitrary option. In this particular dialog box, it tells you for this particular line that has been plotted, it needs to be rotated 3.49 degrees clockwise. We don't change anything here, we just hit OK. And you'll see that the image swings round. Now it still doesn't feel quite straight, but it is a demonstration of how to straighten an image. Now whenever we get these wedges down the side, we need to go into the crop tool. Always check as well here, folks, that these are clear. I just need to click clear there. We're going to make a selection of the whole item and then I'm just going to bring in the corner whilst I hold down the shift key. And the objective here is that we bring the crop in sufficiently to not include the wedges, the coloured wedges basically. And then we can sort of move the crop about to suit ourselves. Now anything on the outside that is currently tinted will be cut away. Anything on the inside that's bright will remain. And whenever I hit return here, the edges get cut off and we have a straight image. Thanks for listening.